Oh my goodness, rest is a beautiful thing. So now, if I was, I can go around back. There's my hat, I just wonder what I did with my hat. Now I suppose I can go around back and figure out what's the better way to get this tin up there. I mean, I could take it around the building and hand it up, or wouldn't have to carry it as far as if I can just put it up here and that might can do that just bring it over here and set it there and climb up and pull it up i might give that a try i'll need me some big gloves it up over my head on the front side. Uh, I don't uh, I don't have my screws in my thing yet. My drill. But I'm probably gonna want them pretty quick here. So maybe what I'll do is sit y'all up here and I'll go down and uh, Sit you right there for now. So this is kind of how I think this will work, and this is sort of what I did on the other side. I put that little piece there to catch the end of the piece of tin, so I can slap it up there and let it come down. And rest on that while I position it there's a little bit of a ridge on the tip on the inside tip of that board that matches with the ridges on the tin and if I get it just right it'll leave me the right amount of hangover so that it matches up there which is I think about three or three and a half inches so if I line this tin up straight on that piece and get it to meet up there, everything should turn out to be oh about the same all the way across on the back side as it is on the front side. So I'm gonna sling this piece of tin up in place and wrestle it around a little bit until I get it where I like it and I'm gonna shoot a few screws into it. And sort of match the bottom piece up that top piece and I'm going to go underneath it where I can see those little ridges that I were talking about on that corner piece, side piece on the tin. And I can also see, I'll bring y'all down here, I should also be able to see how this is lining up. And over here, those are these steps. punctured the tin. I drive it through with a screwdriver. Now I'm going to come down here again and look at my angle. See that inside lip? I don't know if you can see it from here. But that inside piece of tin that side piece or that corner piece slips up inside of this one. I don't know if you can see that or not. 
with a little ridge there that that sits on. And that lines the whole thing up. So that if I can do this without falling down. So if I come over here, I can see that the outside tin is right on the edge of that groove there. And it's the same up here, all the way to the top. And then notice my two top pieces meet together perfectly. I'll leave it just like that. It's considering whether to tap it in a tiny bit, but I don't think so. I think it's good.